Apart from all that passion and desire to build things, salary is always in your mind while you're pursuing your graduation and are now about to choose a major. So, you start comparing average salaries of various engineering disciplines in your country. Hence, the most obvious question you have in your mind right now is how much a civil engineer makes. So, our today's video is about the average salary of a civil engineer, along with perks and compensations, you'll get when hired as one in your country. Welcome back to imcivilengineer.com, your very own home of civil engineers. If you're new to my channel or is not subscribed, please hit subscribe to get latest construction and civil engineering updates. Well, your actual salary in your country will depend on your job role or job description, as well as the experience. Some highest paying civil engineering job roles include project managers, senior planning engineers, contract specialists, and senior design engineers. However, the salary varies from project to project and from location to location. So, you know what I try to stick with the average salary just to give you an idea, and I'll try to cover as many countries as possible. So, let's delve in. Just to organize the things, I try to arrange my list as per the highest paying countries for civil engineers. So, even if you're looking to immigrate, this video will come handy. So, at the top of my list is Switzerland. This happiest country on the planet is able to pay around USD 77,438 per year, that's around 7 to 5 thousands in Swiss franc. Their local currency. Anyhow, you can expect to even earn more as the economy is bustling and super growing. The next is Denmark. This Scandinavian country offers around $71,565 per year. That's around 504,000 Danish krom, the local currency. The thriving cities and idyllic landscapes has diverse job nature roles for civil engineers. Now, I'm moving to Norway, having the gigantic building and construction industry. If you'll become a civil engineer in Norway, you can expect to have an average salary of around $67,154. That's around 654 thousands Norwegian krone, the local currency. Norway is looking for diverse and talented civil engineers in building and construction sector. So, where'd you like to go next? Well, the next on my list is US. Having around 7.6 million employees relevant to construction and civil engineering. This growing construction industry is happy to pay you around $62,000 a year. The industry is valued around $1.36 trillion at the end of the current year. Are you an Australian? Well, if you become a civil engineer, your average salary will be around $55,155 a year. That's around $78,000 Australian dollars a year. But you know what? The construction industry here produces around 9% of GDP with annual grown rate of 2.4% in next five years. That's an awesome growth, I must say. So, you're living in freezing weathers of Canada. But here the average salary of a civil engineer is around $47,262 per year that'll make it around $60,000 Canadian dollars. The thriving construction industry here has more than 1.4 million employees generating around $141 billion annually to the economy. Now I'd love to go to Germany, as I love German-speaking people. Well, a German civil engineer can earn an average salary of $44,803 a year that's around €42,000. Germany houses the biggest construction market in Europe, so there are pretty awesome opportunities to grow rich as a civil engineer here. Do you know? The construction in United Kingdom is the largest of all. With employees of over 3.1 million people, it comprises of around 9% of the workforce of the entire country. With more research on sustainable materials and labor-intensive model, you can easily find an opportunity here. The English civil engineers make around $40,000 a year, that's around 32,000 British pounds. As I've covered the rich countries of the world, Let's now move on to some progressing construction sectors of the world. 
In India, civil engineers are making around $4,000 a year. That'll be 307,000 Indian rupees. Here the construction industry is the largest in terms of creating investment opportunities across various related sectors. It accounts for around 8.2% of the construction industry. Now I'm going to the next country. For Pakistani civil engineers, the average salary is around $3,800 a year, that's around 500,000 Pakistani rupees. But here the numbers are not obvious. It varies a lot among different companies, job roles, and regions. Civil engineers working in mega projects are earning more than those working in ordinary projects. Let's now move into Bangladesh. You know what the civil engineers here are making around $3,300 a year. That's around 290,000 Bangladeshi taka a year. Here the construction industry has more infrastructure projects and urbanization projects. The value of the construction sector here is around $81.7 billion in 2021. Now comes the progressive construction sectors of Asia, Philippine. Here, the construction industry is growing around the rate of 22% in 2021. If you're in Philippine, as a civil engineer, you can earn around $4,500 a year, that's around 258,000 Philippine pesos a year. At the last, I'm going to mention Malaysia. The construction sector here is growing at more than 10% than previous years. There are a number of high-valued infrastructure and energy projects. Here the average salary of civil engineers in Malaysia is around $9,046, that's around 39,000 Malaysian ringgit. At the last, I'd like to conclude that in Asia, the top country for paying civil engineers is China that's even more than some of the English countries I've talked previously. Anyhow, in Malaysia, the salary is also pretty awesome. So, I tried my best to include as many countries as possible and to discuss the civil engineering salary. What do you think about numbers? Don't forget to tell us how much you're earning in the comment section below with your country's name. That's all about our today's video. I hope you've loved it. Please do subscribe and share it with your friends. It'll help our cause in spreading education without spending a dime.